<laughs> oh, what is this? There's a guy like right here somewhere. He keeps on popping his head up on my video. <laughs> Where's your head gone, you silly man? There he is, there! He keeps on peeking up on my video. <laughs> He's doing it again! <laughs> oh. Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Star Lords and today I hope that you're having a fantastic day anyway, that's that's first things first. I hope that you're having a fantastic day, you enjoyed school, work or whatever you do, I just hope that you're having a good day. Uh, so yeah, I've got a lot planned. We've actually got the second episode of my Pokemon Brick Bronze series being uploaded as we speak. That'll be up in the next couple of hours guys, so please keep an eye out for that. And uh, yeah, I may also be doing a Shiny Legend live stream, so that'll be pretty cool too. But before we get into those two, we actually have some pretty awesome new about the arcade update for Pokemon Brick Bronze. Now, I know not a lot of you guys actually use Twitter and you guys don't tend to keep in the loop on Twitter and that is where most of the big news hits, you know? So that's why I'm here. I'm gonna be showing you guys two official tweets, one from T. Bradem, the main kind of developer at Pokemon Brick Bronze and also from Lando. And uh, yeah, so before we get into the video guys, don't forget to leave a like and uh, let's get into having a look at our first glimpse at the arcade update. Uh, so here on screen right now is a tweet from Brad uh, at tbradm and he says, Coming soon, TM, to another, to, wait, 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 whoa, 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 coming soon, TM, to an Anthean city near you. Okay, yeah, that was just kind of confusing, I'm sorry. Uh, but as you can see, guys, it's actually the arcade that we're going to be seeing in the arcade update, and it looks pretty cool. It's got that whole retro kind of look and feel to it with the pink and blue and the purpley kind of uh, color gradient. I love that, by the way. Uh, that's like my favorite kind of colors, as you can probably tell from the text in my thumbnails. Interestingly enough, uh, it looks like there's a couple of prizes on that back shelf. There's not really many. It looks kind of empty, to be honest. It looks like a run-down casino or or rung down kind of arcade kind of place. Uh, but yeah, we have in the bottom left hand corner, we have a uh, ticks, which is going to be tickets that you win from doing certain things. We don't yet know what exactly the arcade machines are going to be, but I hope that they will be extremely, extremely fun. But either way, yes, we do get ticks as they're called, and we can then exchange those tickets for prizes. And it looks like I think that we have a couple of candy prizes over on the far right hand side of the actual shelf, that looks like maybe rare candies. Then we have Ash Ketchum's hat on the top left, that might be an actual wearable thing in the game, so that's pretty cool. And then we have this huge big box, just right there, a huge big box on screen. And that looks very, yeah, that looks like it's gonna be the big prize of this arcade. Oh, and also we have a Mimic doll. Uh, I'm assuming that you'll be able to use them in battle, so that when, like, um, a Pokemon attacks it, um, it'll be like, oh, they attacked like the Mimic Pokemon and then your Pokemon will be sent out. I don't know, if you've played Pokemon before uh, on the actual consoles, you will know what I'm talking about. Uh, but yeah, I'm actually just really curious to see what that prize is in the box. Now we do know that Ditto is going to be available to get at the arcade. And uh, I actually know of one, one huge Pokemon that we're going to be seeing in the arcades, but I'm not able to actually disclose that information, guys, as, uh, yeah, it can actually risk me from being uh, probably removed uh, from PBB. I'm not too sure about that, but I can tell you that it's going to be a pretty awesome Pokemon. It's bigger than Ditto, way bigger, so yeah, and uh, you guys are going to love it, but either way, we still are going to get a chance to win Ditto at this arcade, which is pretty fun. It is really fun indeed, uh, but yeah, now we go over to the next tweet, which is from Lando, and he says, in other news, we're working on the arcade this week. When the arcade is complete, we'll set up another poll for what we should work on next. Um, and that's pretty interesting. He tweeted that out just yesterday, actually. So that means that uh, we could possibly be seeing the arcade update out this week. I don't know whether they'll just complete it this week or it'll be out this week. I'm not too sure, but I'm thinking, uh, yeah, 
de definitely clear your schedule for Saturday or Sunday, as that may be the day that it comes out. And uh, interestingly enough, they are giving the players a choice here with uh, setting up yet another poll. Hopefully there is some good choices. I'm more excited for the uh, kind of like to build your own house kind of update. That would be so cool. Uh, but yeah, until then, I'll kind of keep my expectations low. Maybe they'll do like more hoverboards or something. I I I'm not too sure. But either way, the arcade looks very cool. The whole layout of it, the bluey green, uh, bluey pinky kind of purpley colors look very appealing to me. And uh, yeah, it just looks like it's going to be an awesome place for people to go daily on Pokemon Brick Bronze. Uh, so yeah, guys, if you did find this information useful and it was new to you, please remember to leave a like. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can get to like 800 likes on this video. That'd be extremely cool. But anyway, guys, I hope that you all have an awesome day. Good luck with today's Lotto Drawers. And uh, yeah, until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.